Uh, welcome to our special section called the NX Update, where we talk about the X every time until it comes out. Yeah, because <laughs> we because yeah. we love it because we, we think do. it's going to be good. Do we? I think it's good. Oh, well, I, I'm 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 a huge Nintendo fan. I've been yeah. following Nintendo for years now, huge amount of time. If you don't know what we're talking about, NX is the new Nintendo console. Something. Yeah. The new Nintendo console. How great console. will it be if they call it that? Uh, the new, new Nintendo console. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> the no, new Nin- Wii, Wii U. Nintendo One. If they call it the new Wii U, I'm not, I'm not going to buy it. Just straight, even if it's amazing, I'm just not going to buy it. <laughs> right, so uh, the new Wii U is... I'll uh, buy it, I'll buy it. There's been some rumours. Who knows the rumours? You guys are a bit... I know, your second-hand rumours. My second-hand no. rumours. Yeah. Once he started, or...? I haven't read anything new about it. Alright, so um, do you want to give us a rundown of what, what what's come out? Okay, well, quite a few little bits and pieces have come out. The, um, the most recent being that the SDK for the NX has, has gone out yeah, least, to yeah. some developers. Um, and I've heard a bunch of things from... Uh, some. There was one developer, or so, anonymous source, I guess they always call them, that said that uh, they couldn't get running at anything at 60 frames a second, even using the most recent... Uh, Intel processors, which means this well, it's what means one of two things: it's either terribly optimized SDK, mm. Mm. or it's really powerful. Yeah, and it requires really strong, powerful hardware um, the, the, above and beyond what is currently out. The rumor mm. I heard was industry leading <clears throat> tech. Yeah, interesting. Yeah, yeah. So that kind of says it. It, it would yeah. kind of lean to the fact that. It has higher hardware specs than the PS4 and the Xbox. Yeah, which, oh man, I've been let down by this for like the last two two generations. Yeah. So it makes you think, why would they go that far to build in the tech? It's like they've, they've never been one to really directly compete with No, they, that's with the problem. PlayStation and Xbox? Just because yeah. they hadn't the last two generations doesn't, doesn't mean they, they weren't before, before But it's, it's yeah. they've been so successful not doing that, just being that kind of I every gamer home console. Successful. No. The Wii was well, not, not, the, not the Wii U, but just, just Nintendo's focus on everything in general. Yeah, I, yeah. I've never heard of their focus being on, let's go super tech-based. Well, the GameCube was. Seem... The GameCube yeah. was, the really? N64 was, yeah, they were. the Super Nintendo They led the way for a long time. Oh, okay. Um, but, and, and, and Nintendo have an amazing track record of being like, this is an amazing console, that's yeah. crap. This is an amazing console. That's crap. Like for the last like, mm. you, with the GameCube, the, the GameCube wasn't crap, but Curious, it failed. Yeah. It was a yeah, failure. Yeah. Um, the, then the Wii U came. Uh, the Wii came out, and it was like <coughs> a, a record success. Yeah. And then the Wii U, and it was terrible. Like it was a failure commercially. Yeah. And now it's time for their success again. Um, so I think there's some really interesting rumors that came out. Um, and like I'd like to compare these two rumors because I think they're really weird and contradictory. So there's the rumor industry leading tech, like the hardware is yeah, amazing. Yeah. They've removed two of the buttons, so you only have two buttons. I haven't on. heard that one. So yeah. I don't think that I, I do not believe that'll be real. <laughs> Old day you know, gaming. I don't two think so. buttons. So it looks like the the um, the the, uh, the patents that went out for their new controller. It looks like it's like a smaller Wii U gamepad. Yeah. Um, except they've removed two of the face buttons. So you've got an A and a B, mm. and then you've got your joysticks and your triggers and your screen. Um, and uh, the rumor is that it can be used as a home console or taken as a portable console. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, removing two buttons? I don't, it won't happen. The 3DS has got four face buttons. Yeah, this is Every single also. other controller has four face buttons minimum. And it's uh, the whole idea of their next console will be to get back third party support, yeah. and they're not going to get third party support with if they're yeah you know, with two buttons gone. They're going to they want to they are wanting to make it, or they should be wanting to make it as easy as possible for someone to take their multi platform PS4, Xbox, PC game, and just go boom. Well, maybe, maybe they're sick of that and they don't want to do that because that's what they tried with the Wii U and they were like no, mm, they're, they're, they're like, eh, they're dis- like they lost <laughs> they had third party support at the yeah. start of the Wii U and it was strong their launch title had so many strong ported like uh, Xbox 360 and PS3 games yeah and then when the Xbox One and PS4 came out all support's gone and it's because it's not as easy as just saying hey I'm going to put this game on this on the Wii U they have to make new assets they have to use lower quality textures. They have mm. to downgrade everything to put it on. As well as Nintendo saying, hey, we've got a touchpad. You have to use that as well. Yeah. Mm. And so they're just like, you know what? Not going to happen. And they lost all their support. There's no... And, and since then, they've just gone worse and worse. Sales has dropped off. It's just... Oh, well, they've had peaks with, obviously, uh, Mario Kart and Mario Maker, Smash Brothers yep. all coming out. They had big peaks for those. But in general, it's failed. And it's failed because... You cannot own it as a uh, an all-in-one console. 
You can't have that in front of your TV and know you can experience what everyone else is playing, except mm. for some exclusives. I think, and I'm going to predict, that they're ballsy enough to go out and say, we're not taking your ports, you need to make games exclusively for the system. It's so different. We've got the touchpad, we got only two buttons, mm. it has to work at both home and on the go, and you can either be there or not. I can see Nintendo doing that. I think if I think if they have the two buttons, they will lose their handheld and home console market. It'll just die. There's, <laughs> yeah, there's there's. I cannot imagine uh, Capcom yep. making another successful Monster Hunter game using two buttons. Hmm. Yeah, it triggers. Even with that, like, even with yeah. those, you need. Well, how it does Bayonetta? Realize, could you does imagine a, a new Bayonetta game on your TV with two buttons? A, yes. a Metal Gear Solid game yeah. with only two buttons. Wait, what? Yeah, I don't know. Because I, when you said this to me, I was like, I could definitely imagine Nintendo doing that. Like, I actually could. If you don't think about it too hard, <laughs> they could do it. <laughs> yeah, like, but as soon as you think weird. about it, it No, but apart. like, yeah, when you think about it from how you would expect them to think about it, you're almost definitely wrong. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, I, I could see them saying, you know, we see so much value in this this week this game pad with the screen yeah that they would remove two buttons and be like well you want those buttons they touch the screen the only way that there's only two buttons on the face is if there's buttons underneath i think they'll have okay that to me that's the only way Maybe. or if there's uh, you know that's that, that's the only way yeah I, there's no way they're just going right. to go back to did the, did the patent that you saw did it specifically state reducing buttons to two or did the picture just happen to have two buttons on it unsure because I saw, I saw a similar patent, uh, patent was, was, uh, showed that the controller that looked similar to the Wii U, it only had two buttons on the front as well, um, but it also didn't have the, didn't signify like a home, a start, a select, anything like that. It didn't signify the microphone that's already on there, the NFC, nothing. Yeah. I think it was just to denote that, hey, it's a controller. Right. And the patent that I saw was that there are sensors down each side that you can maybe put an amiibo to the side of your controller. And it will read something, or you can swipe down on the table next to your controller, and it will pick up that you're swiping. So you can control next to the controller as well. Mm. But I swear that the, that means the the one because the one I saw only had one stick and two buttons. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It was just showing, hey, it's a controller. We're not going to just draw the entire controller because yeah, it hasn't okay. been finalized. Mm. Possibly. There's no way it can be two buttons. It's a trick patent. It's actually a headset. <laughs> yeah. They're going into yeah. VR. Yeah. Did, did, did it have dual analog sticks, the one you saw? Um, I, I only remember it saying uh, they removed two buttons, that it was two buttons on the face, and they had some kind of proprietary button on top, right. which was scrollable. Yes, yes. Scrollable, oh, a scrollable. scrollable clickable like, yeah. wheel. Yeah, I've yeah, heard about yeah, that yeah. as well. Huh. Um, which is kind of cool. I actually really like the idea of that, like flicking through inventory. Really yeah, good. so yeah. maybe that's maybe that's a replacement for the other buttons. Like maybe, maybe. Who who, who thinks it's going to have two face buttons? Let's Mortal, have a vote. Mortal Kombat with two face buttons. Do they want you to be able to pull? I don't know. What does Nintendo want? Because there are a lot of Nintendo games which you only use two buttons for. It like, would be different and interesting. Yeah, I I don't know. I, I'm still on the fence with it. Like I I understand what you're saying. Mm. I don't mm. know, but I just don't know if they that's what they want from it. I could yeah. see them being like, yeah, no. Okay, well, let's, let's think about like some Nintendo games then, uh, like Pikmin or or Zelda. Could you play those with yes, two, two face yeah, Zelda game? You could yeah. play a Zelda game differently. Yeah, easily. Hidden block. You got your screen for your inventory. Yeah, yeah. You got your scrollable buttons for whatever else you need. Yeah. Plus, yeah. Throw a bomb, maybe. The, you know, you get your triggers. You know what I can see them doing. I can see them making this controller and having two holes where the buttons should be, <laughs> and then they give you a customizable button when you buy the console. But then you can customize it with different characters on the faces of the buttons. <laughs> I, I That's actually, Nintendo. I think what's happened is they've said we made this Wii U. We wanted to do pay support. They didn't support us. Yeah. Screw them. We're going to make what we want to make, and if they want to be a part of it, they can build for our system. <laughs> I could see them. I don't know if they're that so harsh. I don't know if they're, they're they that got the cash flow to do it. I read something where they could fail for the next five consoles yep. and, and be fine. Yeah, they've got a lot of cash. <laughs> yeah. And they'll just yeah. keep making Amiibos, yeah. so it's fine. But the, and, and I guess the reason, they've got that money not so much because of the Wii U, but for because of the Wii yep. and the DS yep. and 3DS. That's it. Yeah. Right? And if they had a, a home console that only had the two buttons and it was also <laughs> a portable, yeah. I think they would kill their portable market. Well, there's they, a, there's a reason. heaps of them. <laughs> There's a so reason. they would win anyway. Yeah. There's a they reason. either don't kill their own market or they sell heaps and kill their own market. There's a reason they've evolved to having more buttons. Like Nintendo mm. have, haven't decided, are oh, we just going to follow everyone else? 
They didn't True. move. Heaven, they didn't. They didn't. They were the first to move to four buttons, and Sega moved to six face buttons. I think it yeah. was. Um, they didn't do a right analog stick until Sony had already done one because it, it showed that oh, it, it might actually work. Then they added the C controller off for the GameCube. Yeah. Um, and you know, then they they actually tried to remove buttons for the Wii. They went down to basically just having the A and B button. They did, and everyone hated that. And then they also said, yeah, games only need an A and B button, but here's an Nunchuck that has two more buttons as well. Yeah. Mm. Um, so but they, they had to make all their games from then on playable without the Nunchuck. Yeah, not all of them. Not all, because the, the console came with a Nunchuck. Uh, did, yeah, it came with a Nunchuck. Okay. So you had, and then they decided to add a plus and minus button as well. Uh, okay, so we, yeah, okay, we'll put two more buttons. <laughs> Maybe we need two more buttons Maybe as well. Maybe we're going to get an add-on for this but, new game fair that puts more <laughs> see, buttons. With so, see? So it's kind yeah. of like you only need A and B, but yeah. here's a C and a Z, uh, and a minus and a plus, and then there's a home button as well. Interesting. So I think they know they need buttons. It'd be ridiculous for them to go yeah. take them all, but just to get. I'm going to go with two face buttons. I'm, I'm going to say going. there'll be it won't be there'll be just the standard A B X Y. I'm going to go with no. DLC buttons. <laughs> <laughs> it's like what they've done with what you just described there. Oh, they gave you one thing and then another. Pre-order no, no, bonus. You don't pay for any of that. Yeah. It all came with buttons. the console. So the other yeah. bit, but I mean, are they going to just build that in afterwards, or? Uh, I don't know. I, don't, I think it'll be A B X Y. The other big, the other big thing, obviously, is no optical media. Yes, nothing. No drive. Yeah. So no this drive. is the part where do you like if Jordan was right? The well, cloud, that was the only the thing cloud. Jordan was right about. Right? No, I said it would be a, it would be a, pla- a cloud based platform. You download your games onto the system. And you could also, uh, the same system for portable. But you see cloud-based, which insinuates that you're not actually downloading, you're just streaming video. That's what a yeah, cloud-based streaming. gaming system yeah. is, is. You're streaming the video, you don't download anything. Like PlayStation TV uh, or whatever it no, is. I, so, yeah, so I kind of meant it more as in the, right. it's all downloadable media and right, right, it's right. all cross-buy. So everything that you can download from the store, whether it's Mario 8 or whatever, yeah. um, you can play that on your, your home little Apple TV-like next system yeah and it also stores on your gamepad and you can wander off and play that on the train mm. Mm. I I think That's it'll be dream. download only yep. I absolutely think that I've been wanting download only for the, like this current generation what does that mean from the New Zealand shaped cartridges and you just scan them You'd probably have it scanning for a while, right? Because you'd do... Uh, well, no, no. Like it it like... scans your ownership of it oh, and right, tags right, it just right, like right. Steam goes. And that's, another, yeah, that's yeah. An, another Nintendo. Like, <laughs> exactly. To all the retailers. Because now it's like, you don't get to sell our stuff at full retail. We do. And that is why Microsoft and Sony have been <laughs> yeah. so against doing it. Because they don't want to like upset... Yeah, but Nintendo yeah. seems to just not care anymore. Everyone right. turned their back on them. They so they why, were like, why should a game developer yeah. care um, about putting their stuff into stores? Yeah. I mean, I can see, I can see Xbox not being able to. If you can only to... play it on one console, why would you want to put it into stores when you can just? If yeah, they sure. have the console, you give them the store and the console they've already yeah. got. Why do you need to have? Other a, than... They don't compete with anyone, so they can do it. I guess they're as I mean, a consumer, yeah. that's the biggest thing. Yeah. Is you like, just won't if, be able to. Like, if Xbox came out and said, "You know, we're not doing retail games," everyone would be like, well, "I'm going to buy the PlayStation one." Yes. If Nintendo said it, no one's going to be like, "Oh." <laughs> <laughs> Sega has Mario as well, you know. Oh shit! Like you can't do that. That could be the biggest problem: is is Nintendo going away? Since you cannot get the games elsewhere, yeah, we're never going to drop our prices. Yeah, this sure. is pretty much what they do. Anyway. They they right, pretty yeah. much do that anyway. But they have, if, they have been yeah. doing a few more sales on the eShop and stuff. Oh, recently. but you can't download yeah, you that to your three hundred meg card. Mm. That's true. <laughs> if you went to if you went to JB Hi-Fi and you looked at some of the the DS titles that came out three, four, five yeah. years ago, they're still almost at full retail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those games just don't drop in price. Yeah. No. That's because people pay the price. If people didn't pay for them, yeah. then they would drop. But people mm. are like, eh, I'll pay for yeah. it. Nintendo can be fine. Nintendo yeah, they're going to be, be fine. fine. <laughs> Even if they do release a two-button yeah. controller. <laughs> um, so the portability, I guess that was the other thing that they said, um, uh, that there is, the, it's going to be the console and at least one mobile device, they said. Mm. They used the words one mobile device. Now, it's that you can either take with you, oh. that you can take with them. And I don't know if they're using mobile in that way, as in it's portable, yeah. so it's mobile, or if it's a mobile device, like a cell phone. Mm. Oh, God. Everyone, oh, can you imagine? Lose their minds. Yeah. Like you said, a little thing that you sit, a little console that you sit there, yeah. and it comes with a smartphone. There's just been but rumors about Nintendo like... phones for ever and yeah. a day, though. So I don't know. They're but, I mean, found it in something. industry leading tech and then mobile. Like, is it? Think of this: you take the mobile that you get, your smartphone, yeah. and you clip it into a controller. You now have a touch screen with buttons. 
I I could nah. I, I don't I can't see it because of the audience. I think Nintendo the still wanna be that family company. Yeah. And they're not gonna give kids mobile phones. <laughs> I, <don't laughs> I think kids are getting mobile phones. I think they are getting them anyway, but I don't think yeah. Nintendo think they are. They don't look out the window. They, they <laughs> think what's happening. You know, they think they think the kids have the dismans and the roller yeah, skates yeah. and stuff like Yeah. yeah. Um yeah, I, I don't know. I don't, can't see that happening. I think it's going to be the gamepad at like per Wii U with a processor that can now it's more powerful. You don't think it'll be smaller than the current gamepad? I think it I, might th- be. I think it might be three D S size. Yeah, it's going to be more powerful than the Vita. Will it be um, glasses free three D? Mm-hmm. If it's going to replace the three D S as well, is it going to be glasses yeah, free three D? Probably. Yeah. I hope so. I I'd love. I love that part yeah. of my three D S. And also the new three D S. The glasses 3D is real good. It's amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've really perfected it. It's yeah. great. Not the X, XL or something. That's uh, the, the new, new Nintendo. Oh, yeah, it's called the yeah. yeah, yeah, I have seen them. Sorry. The new yeah, yeah. 3DS and 3DS XL. Yeah, so that was our update of the yeah. new Wii U. So mm-hmm. Jordan was kind of right. Yeah. You're kind of right. Yeah. You got some. You yeah, had got the crystal ball. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. We should actually review it anyway and just yeah. have a look and just be like, oh, okay. No, don't do that. We'll do that. We'll do that when <laughs> E3 comes around 2016. Yeah. We'll have yeah. a look over it and actually write down what we Because I feel like in the first predictions we did, I actually got bullied out of my opinions. <laughs> yeah. And at the end, I was like, oh, nah, nah, I didn't mean that. Like, nah, who's laughing? All right. Hitting the bell. <laughs>